Hey guys, it's Raphael, amigos, Rafael. Uh, we have a very interesting piece here. Uh, uh, something that you really never see. Uh, my compadre got this from Cancun. My compadre compró esto en Cancun, uh, which is very cool, but it broke in, you know, in the trip back. So, take it all. Now, it's very thin in areas, so it's going to be a little bit tricky to uh, make this work. But, um, está muy delgado en ciertas partes. Así que vamos a hacer lo posible. It's very cool, though. It's actually the predator. It's el predador. I tell you, it's amazing work these people do up there uh, in Cancun area. Just amazing. So, uh, got all the pieces. Todos los pedazos. Uh, let's see what we can do. Vamos a ver qué se puede hacer con esto. Okay, so we have all these little goodies. The legs, las piernas, los brazos. And all these guys. Uh, again, very thin here. Very, very thin. Muy delgado aquí. Uh, so what I'm going to do is um, we need to reinforce this somehow. Uh, vamos a, ¿cómo se dice? Reinforzarlo. Bueno, a veces tal vez invento mis palabras, pero ojalá me entiendan. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. Esto es lo que vamos a hacer. Okay, so what I'm going to do is use these dowels, put them right in here, and I'm going to fill this up with uh, resin. Voy a llenar esto con resina, con estos, este, uh, bueno, estas cosas, los palitos estos para reposar las piernas. And this is equal amounts, las mismas cantidades, A and B. Again, you have to be, you know, kind of quick with this one. This one dries very, fairly quick, and it does get very hot. Se pone bastante caliente cuando ya se va enfriando esta cosa, y es rápido. So. Okay, so I had to uh, fill it up three times. Tuve que llenarlo tres veces uh, for it to fill up all in here. Uh, you can see that it was a little hole in there. That's why a little white stuff came out through here. Un poquito salió de aquí porque tenía un hueco. But um, it's good because this will be reinforced. Uh, estaría más fuerte la área de la pierna, which is very important. Now what we're going to use, crazy glue, cola loca. Just to help us keep these in place. Nada más para que nos den... Este bueno, que se pegue bien, pero ya luego lo vamos a, a poner más resina. Okay, now the crazy glue is on there, but we want to make sure that this will fit before we put some more resin in here. Tenemos que ver que esto va a quedar bien antes de poner la más resina. This one's a little wobbly because of the broken area there. Whoa. Okay, that's that's where it should be. Okay. Okay, before pouring in a little bit more of, of the resin, I'm not going to fill these guys up with resin. No need to. Uh, you just want to go maybe up to here, just to reinforce it. Because uh, it'd be, uh, it's just too much resin and it, no sense doing that. We're going to fill them up with something else. Vamos a llenarlo con resina, pero no hasta arriba es demasiado resina. Nada más va hasta por aquí, vamos a hacerlo. But before that, we want to make sure it doesn't leak. Vamos a estar seguro que no vaya a salirse de un lado. So I'm putting clay, estoy poniendo plastilina. As you can see, it leaked through here. Uh, pueden ver que salió de aquí. But before it hardens completely, I can still go in here and take this off. Antes de que se seque bien, puedo quitarlo aquí antes de que se ponga muy duro ok, 
while we're waiting for this guy to be nice and cold, uh, mientras esperemos que esto se enfríe y esté bastante frío antes de quitarlo, before we take this part off, uh, he is missing a uh, arrowhead. Now, I guess the best thing to do is to find one, but I actually don't know where to find one right now. So what we'll do is we'll mold one of these and make one. Ah, no sé dónde conseguir estas, este, puntas de, de, no sé cómo se dicen, de flecha. Pero vamos a crear una para ponerla ahí. What I'm using here is just equal amounts of the uh, mold putty. Estoy usando el, el mold putty que es una uh, silicón que se seca. No, no rápido, pero, you know, it's just a putty, you just mix one, one in one. Okay, I'm going to do a little something different on the arm. Voy a hacer algo diferente en el brazo. This is very thin here. And uh, no se puede poner el resin, la resina, porque pues no es, es, no es como las piernas donde está parado. Can't put the resin in here because it's not, you know, I don't want to fill this sucker up. No sense. So I need to find some kind of a support here so I can really get some glue in there. Necesito poner como algo de soporte para que pueda pegar bien el pegamento. So I'm using uh, the... Uh, epoxy scope. Uh, estoy usando el epoxy scope. Mitades iguales. So, once mixed, yeah, que está mezclado, I want to create kind of like a lip. Quiero crear como un, como un este, ¿qué se puede decir? Pues un, no sé, pero ya están viendo. <laughs> Make sure it fits good. Okay. Okay. Cuando se seque eso, then you have a lip to grab onto. Cuando ya se seque bien eso, va a estar fuerte y va a tener algo con que pegarse mejor. We're going to do the same thing on this side. Vamos a hacer lo mismo en este. Okay. Aquí está de este lado. Okay, we got this side now. So once that gets hard, then we'll have where to grab on to. Now you may ask yourself, how do I know, or how do, you know, I mean, how do I know this was the way to go? Um, I don't. I mean, it's just something that I just, you know, came up with at the moment. Uh, so, you know, if it's if it's something, it's that's how you do it, that's the way to do it, that's the right way or the wrong way. I really don't know. I mean, uh, you know, I just figured, you know, that should work. Uh, si te están preguntando cómo supe hacer esto, no es que sepa, sino... Uh, me pongo a pensar en cosas y dije yo cómo sería un, algo más fácil y, y, y que a menos este uh, resulte uh, así que en el momento uno piensa cosas y, y bueno lo bueno es que si yo lo intento y, y resulta les va a resultar a ustedes y este y ojalá les, les sirva para algo ok this is dry ya se secó take this guy off Oh, that came out easy. So, we'll mix up some uh, black resin and put it in there. Vamos a mezclar este resina negra y ponerlo allá adentro. Okay, we're doing equal amounts. This one I'm using smooth cast onyx. This is black. This is una resina negra. Mitades iguales. Okay, as you can see, this is now nice and hard. Ya está duro. Same with uh, under this arm here. Igual aquí. So now we can add glue to this. Podemos poner pegamento. And put it together and it should hold nicely. So we're going to mix up some 5 minute epoxy. 5 minutos. And glue them together. Okay, after removing the clay, después de quitarle la plastilina, it was on there pretty well, so I'm just using some acetone enough to melt the clay away, but not too much to uh, take the paint away. Estoy usando acetona para quitarle la plastilina, 
pero no tanto que voy a quitar la pintura. Ok, again I'm mixing up some uh, epoxy. Estoy mezclando otra vez este el epoxy uh, just to fill up the gaps where I glued the other arm ¿no? para rellenar las áreas donde uh, faltan pedazos. Okay, so now let's take out this uh, arrowhead thing. Let's abrir esta parte de la de la lanza. Okay, I guess that here it is. Okay, before I uh, put them on here, I'm gonna start painting the underarm. Antes de ponerlo ahí, voy a empezar a pintar uh, lo de abajo. And I don't need an airbrush right now. No necesito el, el, el de aire ahorita. So you just want to match the paint the best as you can. Tratar de mezclar la pintura lo mejor que se pueda. Okay, so here I'm just adding the five minute epoxy, which would be strong enough since there's a there's a lip on here, so that's good. Nada más le estoy poniendo el, el epoxy de cinco minutos y como tiene como un labio aquí va a poder este estar bastante macizo. Okay, so the glue's on there and we just set them where it goes. Gonna watch the hand here. Okay, there he is. Yes, está. I'm just going to give it a nice gloss coat since it was glossy. Ya que estaba brilloso, vamos a echarle el brillo para que todo este se vea parejo. So here he is. All done. Aquí está, amigos, ya todo terminado. Very beautiful piece. Una pieza muy muy bonita. Hasta la próxima. Till next time.